Hi everyone, Tim here from vMix and today we're going to begin a new video series called Getting Started with vMix. Now in these videos we're going to cover some basic things like installation, recording, streaming, um, what kind of computer you might need, adding titles and pictures to your production and basic things like that to get you started. So a lot of people might find it really daunting to get into live production and streaming but we're going to show you how really easy it is to get into live streaming and how to create professional looking live productions. Maybe you've just been given the responsibility of live streaming a, a school meeting or uh, doing a sporting event and you really don't know where to start. So these videos are a good place to start watching um, in order to learn how to use vMix. So we have plenty of other YouTube tutorials that go into these topics in huge amount of depth on our YouTube videos um, on our YouTube channel as well. So if you can check those out if you want. Now vMix is live production software that allows you to mix together a lot of different elements to create a live production. So that might be cameras, videos, graphics, titles, websites, PowerPoints, audio, um, desktop capture, all those things are mixed together and switched um, so that you can create a live video production that you can uh, record, stream and also display on big screens or on monitors as well. So you can use it in SD, HD and 4K also. As vMix is software, um, you're able to just download it from our website, vmix.com, as opposed to using a CD or a, a USB or a zip drive. So if you've purchased vMix um, or you're looking to try and find where you can get it, uh, you just go to our website directly. Um, you won't receive anything in the mail or via carrier pigeon. Um, you will just uh, download it from our website. So our website, vmix.com, has all the information that you'll need regarding help and, and downloading the latest version. So we're going to jump over to our website now to see how we do that. Okay, so this is the vmix website here. Um, this is how it looks as of 2017. As you see, we'll have vmix 19 on there, but we're probably up to vmix 20-something by now. Typically on the front page, we'll have a big download free trial uh, section here or a download section in the horizontal menu. So if we click on either of those, they'll go through to our download page. Now vMix offers a free 60-day trial. So you can use vMix for two months essentially or if it's a shorter month, you might be able to use it for more than two months. But yeah, you have 60 days to use the free trial. It's unwatermarked and it gives you the full edition of vMix. So it gives you vMix Pro, so you can use 4K, instant replay, multi-quarter, all the functionality of vMix Pro. Now, if you've purchased vMix already and you have a registration key, this is where you come to download it as well. So you just need to click the download link and it will start downloading vMix. Okay, now once you've downloaded vMix, what you'll need to do is go and find where you've downloaded it to and then start running the installer. So the installer will go through, make sure that you read all of the terms and conditions uh, in the installation and agree to those, uh, and then just follow the, the steps that it takes to install vMix on your computer. Now, once you've installed vMix, it will bring up a screen that will ask for you to enter either your registration key or your email address. Now, if you've already purchased uh, vMix, then you'll be able to enter your vMix registration key in here, which will be emailed to you after purchasing. If you want to try out the free 60-day trial, just enter in your email address here. Or if you'd like to have the basic free version of vMix, um, enter your email address there. So you can only enter your email address into one of those fields. So once that's done, um, you'll either register your um, registration key or you will sign up for the free trial. Uh, once that's completed, vMix will open and you'll be able to select a preset. Now the preset is what your video production is going to run at. You can change this at any point so it's not really that important what you set to it when you first open it. Um, you might want to check to see what your cameras are set at or what your videos are set at and then use that as your preset. For example, 1080p, 30 frames a second or something like that. If you have a lower spec computer, it may be an idea to select 720 or SD when setting up a preset as opposed to using 1080, which is what we're using here. So once you've done that, you've created your preset, um, you are ready to go uh, on your blank installation of vMix. Now before we get into this, uh, we're going to start looking at uh, the interface on the next videos. We're just going to quickly jump back to the vMix website, just to show you what you might need to know. Now on the vMix website, you can learn all sorts of things, including the features of the software, um, the different products that are available within vMix, like vMix Social, Replay, uh, reference systems and vMix Call. 
we have a solutions page as well to see give you ideas as to um, how other people are using vMix and different case studies on that. And then you can purchase on our website here. You can go through our comparison table and see which, which option of vMix might be best for you. Uh, on our partners page, we have our reseller list. Uh, so those people can help you out with building PCs or offer support to you. Uh, we have our streaming partners, our hardware partners, and our software partners as well on this page. And finally, the most important part of the vMix website is the support page. Now on this page, we have our full knowledge base. Um, so we have tons of questions in there um, that people have asked in the past. Our forums where we have our community that can help you out or you can post information about vMix and our full documentation. Now, if you ever have any questions about vMix and you're not quite sure what to do, you can always email us via the email support section on the vMix website. So don't sit back and wonder, oh, I don't know about this, so I'm just not going to bother. Send us an email and we'll be able to help you out. Now, we also have training videos as well with all of the in-depth tutorials uh, listed on our YouTube page that we've created. So we've got some here. We also have a ton on our YouTube page as well. So all of the things that we'll cover in these Getting Started videos are also available on a lot of these training videos also. Now, if you want to keep up to date with all the things that vMix are doing, um, we have an events uh, section up the top as well as our Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, Instagram, and blog. So if you want to really keep up to date, you can follow us on all of those as well. That's how you install vMix, and that's the vMix website, which is great for all of the help that you might need uh, with vMix in the future. So thanks for watching this video, and I'll see you on the next one. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to check the description to view any of the information and links that we've listed in this video. If you'd like to watch another video in this tutorial series, click one of the videos above.